So boom, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. So in today's video, we're gonna be making the car stock once again. Well, not fully stock, we're gonna be taking things off such as the side skirts, the side strakes, and the rear diffuser, and probably the side S2000 badges on the front fenders. So for those who know, in the last video, I did buy some vinyl wrap, and I said I'm gonna review the color today. So basically, I have a sample piece right here, and are you guys ready? Like, sorry it's not the big roll because, you know, I kind of couldn't be stuff bring it all today. So, I just got the sample piece and are you guys ready? Alright guys, also just before I show you the sample, the reason why I'm taking everything off is to basically just prep it for this wrap. But are you guys ready? Drum roll please. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Boom! Check that out. What do you guys reckon? So for me, I absolutely love this color, but I reckon this color is a hate or love thing. So you either really hate it or you really love it. And only a few cars can pull it off. So I'm hoping my S2000 can pull this color off. And you know the S2000, I Googled some with this same color and only some of them can pull it off. It was more of the aggressive type that can pull it off. So I'm hoping my car can pull it off as well as it's not too aggressive. So hopefully it turns out right. So for those wondering what color this is, this is 3M Black Rose. Look at that, what do you guys reckon? Damn, I'm absolutely in love with this color. But like I said, hopefully I can pull it off. So I'm gonna pull the car in and I'll show you guys the car in direct sunlight. So here it is guys, once again, the Black Rose vinyl wrap. So here it is in direct sunlight. It is a bit gloomy today, so this color is a bit darker today. But look at that, look how nice it looks. There it is. It's like a brownish color, but I absolutely love it. Look how sick it is. Look at that, down. So here's a better look. Sorry, you can't really see as the shadow and reflectiveness of this vinyl is showing the sky instead. But here it is, what do you guys think? Damn. Black rose for days, yeah. Look at that. Oof. Look at that. Damn, there you go. Look how sick that looks. Ooh. So you guys are probably wondering how I chose this color or how I decided. Well, I wanted to always wrap the car like I said in the last video or last two videos, but I didn't want to wrap it with like a factory color. So for example, I didn't want to go white. Uh, blue or black because you know the ST does already comes in there So I thought if I'm gonna wrap the car I might as well go something unique that you don't really see so you know I was looking at other colors such as you know bright red like that really glossy red I was looking at other colors like color shift, but then I found this black rose color and it looks pretty sick So look at that far and hopefully it makes the car look hundred times way better Before we start anything gotta have your cup of coffee a eh? Mmm. It's actually lit. Mm -mm -mm. Gotta also chuck on my gloves. As you know, gotta cut on my finger. Don't want that getting dirty and infected. So, put on some sick gloves. Let's go. Alright guys, um, before we actually get started, I know I've been talking quite a lot, the sun is out. Uh, I want to quickly see how the vinyl actually looks in the sun because I haven't really looked at it when it's sunny. So before the sun goes back down, you know, and goes cloudy again, let's have a sus. So here it is guys, in the sun, not too sure how well you guys can see it, but look at that down. It actually brings out the colour, like, bro, I'm actually keen. It's like a dark wine colour, but look at that, down. So yeah guys, enough of me talking, and I guess we'll start off with the side skirts and the side strakes as that's probably the easiest. Diffuser, I might need two people, and uh, you know, it's a bit harder because it's bigger, so I guess we'll just undo a couple of bolts and yeah, it should be done.
Oh yeah guys, while the wheels are off, I just want to take the time to say, look at this. Remember that video I did of me spraying the calipers red? Look at that, it's still A1 and it's still looking sick. Like, I thought it would be faded by now or chipped, but look at that. It's actually still got its redness and there's no crack or chips. It's just a bit dirty, but I'm actually surprised how long it lasts. So that's pretty sick. So if you haven't seen the video, I'll link it um, up above one of these corners. But yeah, far, take a look at that. A1, see, A1 paint job, ZPG panel besting. All right guys, so here's the car without the side skirts. And damn, I gotta say it's 100 times way better. Nah, psych, look at that, damn, looks high as now. Shit. But now I guess oh, this is the hard bit, I don't know how I'm gonna do it alone. But yeah, we're gonna take out the diffuser and it's a bit heavy and a bit awkward to carry. So wish me luck. Alright guys, so everything is now off. It took longer than expected, but thank God for daylight saving. It's like 7 p.m. right now, but there's still hella light. So as you can see right here, got the big boy, got the rear diffuser. So obviously if the rear diffuser is on the floor, it has to be off the car. So as you can see, there's no more diffuser, no more side strakes, and no more side skirts. So basically the back is stock, or basically back to how I first bought the car with just the rims. Well not including a bumper so like I said everything is now off and now I guess what we can do is probably take off these badges and I'm hoping it doesn't look too plain but it doesn't really matter because we can always put them back on after so yeah all right guys look who just <coughs> arrived BM man say gee are you ready for the wrap uh, nah. Oh shit, oh shit. Like the blue's so nice, like why would you- Oh, stop, wait, stop, stop, bro, stop. Your camera off? Yeah, just, you can just return the wrap, bro. Yeah, 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 we'll do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, so we're gonna wrap the car. Not today, though. But, you know, like I said, we have to take off the S2000 badge. So, so we have some fishing line right here. Shout out to Hank, because, you know, Hank likes to fish. So, yeah, we're gonna, I don't know, this is my first time doing it, so I don't know if we should heat it or not. But all I know is you're gonna use the fishing line and then scrape it off, so yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Us, us. Fuck yeah. You want the S? Yeah, I want the S. <laughs> um, want to sell. Oh yeah. Oh. Fuck, that worked pretty good. <laughs> when you put it back. Hi! Hi! <laughs> what? Sorry, I'm Nico. Did you just cut through all of it? Oh, I snapped it now. Hi! What? what? You cut on? through all of it, bro. Yeah. Alright, guys, so everything I wanted to do today is all done. As you can see, the carbon side skirts and the side strakes are off. The rear diffuser is off. The S2000 is now D badged, so then it's easier to wrap. And I thought, you know, just before I end the video, I thought I'll quickly try and wrap the side strokes. So as you can see right here, I washed it. It's nice and shiny now. So yeah, I guess it's ready for wrap. So what I'm gonna be doing is actually just clay barring it. So, you know, get all, all that dirt that, you know, maybe I missed. And then tomorrow before end of vlog, I'll probably try and wrap it. There's a few chips right here, as you can see right there and right there, but I'm not too worried about this as it's only the side strake, so I'm not gonna be sanding it. So I'm just gonna wrap straight over those. But like I say, it's just a side strake. So yeah, I'm gonna clay bar it and then before I end the vlog tomorrow, I'll try and attempt to wrap it.
So yeah guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the new color as much as I did. Make sure to give this video a fat like, P-H-A-T, if you like the color. And comment down below of what you think, if you like it, if you hate it, and you know, what you rate it out of 10. And also guys, you saw just then a time lapse of me wrapping it. Couldn't really finish the time lapse as it took longer than expected. But here is how the side strengths turned out, ready? Check this out, look at that. Look how sick it looks, damn. So we have the stock blue, and then we have the black rose. So look at that, damn. So it was pretty easy to wrap this piece. The only hard bit was to you know stretch it out on the sides here and tuck it in. So there is a few downsides though, as you can see if you look closely, like right here. Not too sure how well the camera can pick it up. But right there, there is a few like air bubbles, and I can't really press that down as there is dust under it. So I think when I was wrapping it, dust probably fell on it, and you know, I couldn't miss stuff re wrapping it. So I thought if I have extra material at the end, then I'll wrap it. But yeah, besides that, it's pretty sick, and besides the bottom here, you know, couldn't really stretch it out. But yeah, besides that, it's looking pretty sick. So look at that, look how smooth it looks. Damn, look how sick I did the edges. Ooh, look at that, black rose for days. But yeah guys, once again, make sure to give this video a fat like, P-H-A-T, and go to the comments down below, and you know, tell me about this colour, what you think about it, and yeah, and hopefully in the next video, I can start wrapping it, but yeah, that's gonna do it for today, I'll catch you guys in the next one, laters! Bro, can someone help me? This is like hella stuck, can't even take it off right as you can see the bolt fuck